Hello Cuckoo Brothers, this is Guiando, I'm back and I hope you guys uh, enjoy your holiday, Christmas and I hope you ate your, uh, a lot of food <laughs> and first of all you need to spend uh, Christmas to your family and loved ones and I hope you have a good one and this coming holiday for new year and this, this is uh, very special especially to the to us like a filipino we always uh, getting something uh, a lot of food to eat on mostly on uh, new year it's like uh, this is our belief that you need to eat something good so for the next year you're gonna be healthy and more blessings and the you're putting a lot of fruits on the table and uh, round things like apples grapes like this uh, that's what they said uh, that's what we believe and uh, some people they put a lot of coins everywhere and you need to jump on the new year's eve on the 12 midnight you need to jump so you can gain height get taller and uh I don't know and I jumped many times but I never I was thinking I'm gonna be six footer but it's not okay <laughs> I'm just kidding and uh, hello guys uh, I remember last time I made a I made a video on the Okuma Alejos the first one I have is the 16 and then the 5 I think the 5 and then 16 now I have a 12 if you notice before in my first video I have only three and now I have the other one the new member of the group is Alejos 12 and it's really really good I like the Alejos 12 compared to 16 for my opinion and I want to see I want to show it to you to compare this one okay I'm gonna open the whole thing so you can see it and I use this one yes uh, last uh, last uh, two months three months ago on Puri the Alejos I want to try this in tuna this uh, next year and uh, I think it's gonna work I like the drug on this one and you can see it you can see it, it's really the sizes I really love it I really love it and uh, what I did last week I went to Okuma and uh, I changed the handle on this one because when I bought the 12 they only have the handle like this what I did is I went to Okuma by Ontario and they switched the handle on this one and now this one have a bigger handle it's perfect for this because it's a little bit bigger compared to pie and this one is perfect for uh, tuna or jigging or something and I think I'm gonna use this for jigging or in the other one in I have the option is the what they call this the Trinidad and now this one yes this is a 16 Alejos and look really nice and looks soft bro I tell you this one is good this one is good now I got the 12 now this is a new member of the group and and I like it you know why it's a little bit smaller compact and you can hold like this perfect and this one for me is a little bit bigger but I love it too and you see the comparison and this one look how the sizes if you can see it on the camera and uh, look at that but I love it you see that and uh, I don't know we're gonna check uh, on the 12 on the 12 the braided on this one is if we're gonna put 80 
or 65 on 65 is 460 460 yards and for 80 pound braided it's gonna be 400 yards it's very good 300 yards is already good already can you imagine you have 400 to 460 yard on this small 12 alejos and it's really smooth and now i have a big handle now big difference big difference nice oh my god and the strong the drag on this one and uh what they call this on per line to retrieve per line is line retrieve is gonna be like 35 inches the drag is like 24 34 pounds and this is 28 ounces the weight of this is 28 ounces 16 let's compare it the weight of uh, 16 is gonna be like 36 and this one is 28 like eight uh eight ounces difference but on the capacity braided line capacity this one is 750 yards oh my god that's a lot i'm gonna spend a lot of money on this line 750 yards for 80 pounds possible is gonna be like 700 yards for 100. oh wow this is perfect for if you're gonna go like 10 days, 7 days, 5 days trip. This one is good because it holds a line. But for 3 days, I think these days, this one is perfect already. For this, whew, I love it. I love it. The 12, this one is good for tuna. And I think I'm going to put 80 in this one. I want to put 80 in this 400 yards. 80, really good. And this one, I'm going to put 100. And then I'm thinking, I saw, uh, what I call this? The, when I forgot, the Power Pro. I found white, and then I think I have a Power Pro. The one I saw is like, uh, you know, the they have uh, multi-colors that every, every color is like 100. No, no, not 100 feet, 25. 25 feet every color and they change this is like four colors and every four colors is gonna be end up like 100 feet oh is that right yeah 100 feet and this one is good but i keep looking on youtube i keep looking on and google and, and i never seen much this one of on the review on that multi-color if it's good for tuna you know you, you when you put tuna a uh, line for tuna and maybe you can cut a big one and you don't know if this one gonna hold the line and then I don't know if you're gonna break or not that's what I'm thinking but it's a power pro I like power pro and uh, they have a uh, expensive one the two that next to that this thing max quarto or something and the other one is I forgot the name it's not but expensive but I'm good enough with a regular power pro that's the one I put always on my on my reel and I think that's good enough and uh, yeah before I put it I proceed the powder and you know what now I have a poor set of Alejos and I really love it and this is a good for tuna the season guarantee I gonna use this for season and my uh, maybe my pen pen pattern I gonna send it to my to the Philippines I'm gonna send it to my Philippines and I have a boat there and when I go home and I'm gonna use it I'm gonna try fishing there and then I'm gonna bring that to Philippines and my Tiagra I had I'm planning to bring my two pen and Tiagra in uh, Philippines I'm gonna use their Putuna and uh, what they call this a GT Giant Tribali and uh bottom fishing i'm gonna use that one and let's see how good it is now i'm gonna keep this okuma here and i'm gonna send the other reels the one i don't need it really need it because i have a lot already i just, i got crazy last year two years ago for this kind of reels now i have too much 
Actually, I have 17 setups right now, and I really need it. Maybe I'm gonna send it some of them to Philippines, and then some of them I'm gonna sell it because I don't need it. Now I have another extra, and I have another Makaira, and I, I never put uh, what do you call it, and I, I never put line yet there. Now and I have too much, too much. Not good, not good. I need to sell it, or I'm gonna put in display. <laughs> And I'm gonna send it to Philippines, maybe that one. And, and so some of my friends there, they can use it while I'm here, as long as they take care of it, taking care of it. And every time they're gonna use it, you need to clean it, wash it, and put oil and keep it on place. And let's see. By the way, and a happy new year to you guys. I just uh, make a little blog right now, short blog, and then I just showing you that I have four alejos right now and i'm so happy and uh now this is the new the new one the new member of the family the 12 and uh okay let's see uh, next year which one is better which one is good and i hope I, I, we cut something good next year this season and next year guarantee we're gonna go in the good one good boat next year we're planning on aztec and pacifica and new luan and legend that's the boat the one we're looking for maybe tomahawk or pacific dawn we're gonna try and but on top list is legend and new luan pacifica and then aztec let's see and we love aztec and pacifica and we're gonna try the other boat let's see it's a new luan is good i'm gonna try that and hi to everybody guys i love you guys and god bless you guys i hope uh uh, you like the the 12 i like the handle and the the clicker let's see how loud oh what happened there you go it's loud the clicker it's loud and i love it i love it let's see here the clicker the 12 is louder than the than the 16 and uh, nice i like the color too i like the color and this one oh i'm gonna use this for this one i'm gonna use this for uh, maybe i'm gonna uh, i'm gonna put another setup for jigging this one is i love this one because it's really really small compact and easy to hold it and this is narrow it's good and for santa rosa island <laughs> san miguel and this is good for bottom fishing for jigging i gonna learn that for next year and before anything else i hope thank you guys for uh, still uh, uh what they call watching our video and uh, share and please comment and then uh, please subscribe in our hookah brothers channel and hookah brothers fishing i love you guys please continue supporting us and I appreciate it. I love you guys. God bless you.